This is Ben with bkashaaudio.com. In this video, I'll show you how to import a Pro Tools session file into the Ardor Digital Audio Workstation. This is useful if you've tracked at a professional studio and don't have Pro Tools at home. It'll allow you to import your session and edit and mix it. First, click Session and then select Import PT Session. I'll navigate to my audio drive and I'm going to select an old Pro Tools session from a client. The extension for this session is PTF, which is an older version of Pro Tools, but the newer PTX files will also import. I'll click OK, and it prompts me with a window that states what version of Pro Tools this was made in, what the sample rate is, and how many audio files and regions it's going to import. I'll click OK. Now this was an audio post-production mix, so I did have some noise reduction plugins and some complex routing schemes occurring in this. For most Pro Tools sessions, they should import without issue if it's just audio files and tracks. However, if you have video tracks as well as some unsupported plugins, you may receive an error. In the case that you receive an error, you can click OK and it will continue with the import. Our import is completed and you can see that each of my tracks is displayed in order, and I have my audio regions. Now I believe the error was caused in this one because of the reference video. It is a track in Pro Tools and it wasn't imported in with the session. Um, it m is only an issue if you're doing post-production or something very complex, but if you're just trying to fly in a multi-track Pro Tools session so you can work in Ardor, it works pretty well. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe, and visit bkashaaudio.com for more tutorials.